gives you advice, yeah, on how to live your life. Hey guys, for today's video we are going to make some birria tacos, so if you are interested in this, please keep watching. This is just how I made it and I am not claiming to be authentic or anything of that sort. So I took a big pot with some water in it and I got my beef. You can sear this beforehand, I chose not to. These are the chilies that I use, so I just, you know, sliced them, I got all the seeds out of both kinds. So next, I'm just adding all my ingredients to the pot. So it was an onion, half an onion, those chilies, and then also some garlic, peeled, and then I added a bay leaf with some salt and pepper. I then added some oregano and some lime juice. I let this simmer for about 45 minutes to an hour. Do whatever you do in the meantime. After that was finished simmering, I did take out all of those ingredients that I put in there because we are going to blend this up. So I took everything out and then of course you want to wait. You don't want to blend this immediately. Everything has to cool down, so give it some time to cool down. So after I felt like it was a safe time to blend, I added a couple of things to our little blended mixture. I added some of this chicken seasoning. I did like one and a half spoonfuls. I added some cinnamon and also some cumin. And then we just blend it up. So I chose to strain everything back in, it's not necessary, you don't have to do that, I just felt more comfortable doing this. I did have some little chunks that, you know, stayed out. So then I put the top back on and I let this cook for about three more hours. After it was done cooking, I did take out the meat and of course shredded that. It shredded very nicely, very tender. So for when we make these, I like to add a little bit of the juice to my meat mixture and get that all mixed up. Again, to each their own. This is not authentic by any means. This is just the way I am doing it. I chopped up some onions and cilantro to go in the tacos and on the consomme. So how I do it is I dip a tortilla in the consomme and then I lay it down on the pan. I add the the mix the meat mixture, some cheese, and then some cilantro and onions, and I close it up and flip it on both sides.
so this is what they ended up looking like we absolutely love these it's so delicious the only thing is that it takes quite a while to make but they are really 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 good definitely try this if you're curious about them If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. I'm going to try to do a cooking video every month. So I hope you guys enjoyed. See you in my next one. Bye.